everyone, welcome to Serving Up the Tea. My name is Lars Melly. One thing that's super important in tennis is the competition aspect to it. So I'm giving myself a competition. Can I make five drinks in a lightning round as fast as I usually make one? Stay tuned. This is Iconic Doubles Cocktails, part one. We got this, lightning round, lightning round. Thunder, lightning. Okay, I believe in myself. Lightning round. First up, we have the Russian goddesses, Makarova and Vesnina. So first thing you're always gonna need is ice. Let's get our ice. For the three-time major champions from Russia, we're going to start with two half and half. They won more majors than I'm using parts for this. So, you know, go them. They won one tour final and above all else for Russia, especially, they won a gold medal in doubles. We're going to need one peppermint schnapps. And when I was thinking about them, I wanted something that reminded me of winter. Vesnina lives in Sochi, which is where the Winter Olympics was. And then we're gonna need one regular vodka. I mean, hello. <laughs> most iconic Russian duos. I needed to do vodka, of course. I only know the word spasibo in Russian, and I think that means thank you. I could be wrong, so I'm not gonna say that now. Or maybe I should for what they, all the entertainment they provided. Move this to our big one. Pick it on up. This is like really great around the holiday times. Get your glass. Go right here. Pour it on out in a martini glass. You're gonna decorate the rim with chocolate syrup. And there you have it, the Makarova Vesnina cocktail. Okay, it's Lucy Huarechka and Andrea Halavakova. We can get this in one take, guys. Next up, we have the Czech Titans, Lucy Hro- <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> no! I don't want to insult them. Okay, um, uh, cut! Next we have, uh, <laughs> Oh god, I need to get it together. I'm gonna have to think of puppies. Okay, cool. Are we rolling? <laughs> Next up, we have Czech Titans. <laughs> this isn't that funny, but it's funny. Oh, it's awful. Commit, commit. Czech Titans, Lucy, <laughs> I was so close. Oh, this is torture. I feel like Sisyphus. I feel so bad that I'm messing your name up. Lucy Horechka and Andrea Halavakova. So for the Horechka Halavakova cocktail, you're gonna first need two of lemon vodka. And I need to make up for lost time. First you need your ice, of course. Boom. Then you're gonna need two. They won two majors, one tour final, and a silver medal in the London 2012 Olympics, losing to my favorite two players, Venus and Serena. Then you're going to need one of pink lemonade. This is fun, this is flirty. Ah! This is a great summer cocktail. And this is sparkling pink lemonade, just adds a little something. Triple sec, one triple sec. Boom, and then we're gonna shake it all about. That's enough shaking. I have my lemon wedge already prepared right here. And then we're gonna put it right on in. Super light, super fun. Love you guys. You two check Titans, you. Boom. It's the Wimbledon champs, Juan Sebastian Cabal and Robert Farah. So for this drink, I wanted to make something that honors the country that they play for, Colombia, and then also just like a very hunky cocktail. So it's gonna be on the rocks, so I'm gonna add a little bit more ice to it. The first thing we're gonna need is one vodka. Boom, and then we're gonna need one coffee liqueur. This is different from Kahlua. We're gonna be using Kahlua too. Fun fact, Robert Farah and I share one of my alma maters. USC, fight on. Was so happy to see him win Wimbledon with Cabal. Then we're gonna need one Kahlua. Great. Then we're going to need two club soda. And this is a drink you can enjoy on the rocks. I would say it's a really good one with like, a, sort of like a biscuit. You know, everyone loves a good biscuit or cookie. It has a very aromatic coffee flavor. And I'm just gonna stir it. There you go, and enjoy. Salute. 
of 2017 was their year. It's Martina Hingis and Letitia Chan. So I know I just said it, but I'm gonna repeat it since it's a great line. 2017 was their year. You're gonna need to start with two pineapple vodka. After you get your ice in there, of course. Always get your ice. Boom. Then you're gonna need two of the pineapple vodka. Boom, and then you're gonna need one of the rest of it. So you're gonna need one Malibu. You're gonna need one blood orange sparkling drink. Boom. And if you want to, this is the optional part for this one, you can opt in to uh, one of the lemon vodka as well. Just to, you know, if you like it a little strong. They won the 2017 US Open and like so many of the premiere and premiere mandatories that year, it was crazy. Um, and then you're gonna shake it. Great. And then we're gonna go ahead and pour. Great, and then I have the lime in there. <laughs> When I think of these two people, I just think happy thoughts. It's Barbara Stritzova and Chase Wei. Hear me out. I know you see this protein powder and you're like, what's going on? When I think of Shea Suwei and Barbara Stritzova, I never know what kind of ball they're gonna hit next. And that's one reason why I absolutely love them. So I'm doing an unexpected, fun, kooky, crazy cocktail to end this lightning round. Lightning round. So what you're gonna need is two of caramel vodka that's chilled. Then you're gonna need two of um, club soda that's also chilled since we're not gonna use ice. And then we're using two thirds of scoop of AMRAP Banana Ice Pop Protein Powder. So let's get to it. We're gonna get two of our caramel. It's kind of like a caramel banana, like a little bit of a banana foster feel to it. Um, it's amazing. It's one of my favorite cocktails I've made so far. And the way that we're gonna shake it is like kind of different too. They just won Wimbledon and it was so fun to watch them throughout the tournament. I love seeing them at Premier and Premier Mandatories. They've won a bunch of those too. They're also just two delightful people who just deserve the best in life. So two thirds of a scoop right there. First stir. But I really wanna make sure that the protein powder gets stirred in with it. I know, look at that color, right? And then I'm gonna just pour it back and forth. Sometimes you do this with like a Bloody Mary. I think it's just best to really make sure you mix up the protein powder. So you're gonna do it with this. It has an amazing smell to it too. This tastes like dessert. And then we're just gonna go ahead and I already have that set up. Boom, just like that. It's the Shea Sue and Barbara Stritzova. Kooky, crazy, and original. Um, okay, so like I'm reading the nutritional facts of this and because you can only consume two to three servings a day, drink responsibly, but get lit. Not too lit, lit to have a good time. This is a really important fun fact. Hold on, it's really good. Did you know that after they won the gold medal, people in like Russian supermarkets, like other Russians, would let them cut the line because winning a gold medal there is like super important? That's impressive. I would expedite my week. I think I just grew some facial hair. Nope, nope, not that. This is a very, very masculine drink though. I'm kind of a mess. <laughs> nope, nope, running away. This is honestly great, guys. I know it's crazy, but it's great. Just like they are. Thanks for tuning in. Like, subscribe, share the grandma. It's really good. But it's like past my bedtime, but I'll still drink it.